Hey Audacious Church, hope you are doing well. My name is Nav and I'm part of the North Location Leadership Team and I'm also part of the Audacious Foundation. So today I want to welcome you to our Missions Week devotions and you've heard some incredible devotions from our team at Audacious Foundation. Today I have the privilege and the honour of telling you a little bit about what I do for the Foundation. So I lead the Rework Programme and the Rework Programme is an employment programme helping people back into work using targeted coaching within a supportive community context. So through this programme we've had some incredible stories and we've seen lives being changed, we've seen mindsets transformed and we've seen long life dreams come into reality. My personal passion has always been to add value to people's lives and to make a difference, to equip people using the skills and the gifts that God has given to me. But did you know that God has given gifts to each and every one of us? Yes, God has given gifts to you. So let's look at what the Bible has to say. So let's turn to 1 Peter 4 verse 10. And this is what it says. So that's 1 Peter 4 verse 10. And it says, each of you should use whatever gift you have received to serve others as faithful stewards of God's grace in its various forms. Each of you should use whatever gift you have received to serve others as faithful stewards of God's grace in various forms. So let's look at a few takeaways from that verse. So number one, you have been given gifts to serve others. The gifts you have been given are to be used to serve others. So these gifts could be spiritual gifts. These could be, you know, taking that time out to listen to someone over a coffee or to speak wisdom into a situation, to build others up, to encourage others or to equip people in the areas that you are gifted in. Number two, we are designed to be in community. We are not meant to walk through life alone, but we are designed to be in community with others. See, when we carry each other's burdens and we help someone, we are not only helping or carrying the burden for that one person. We are potentially impacting generations. We are potentially impacting generations. We are impacting mindsets. We are impacting uh, their confidence as well. See, I often think that once we give our lives to Christ, we could have, God could have just easily raptured us. Um, but I believe there's a bigger picture, a bigger reason to why we are still here. And I believe that's because we are meant to be the hands and feet of Christ, to take the gospel to all nations, to participate in populating heaven and to serve those in need. And there's one way you can play your part today in serving those in need. And that is by volunteering on the Rework programme. So if you look at the current climate with cost, with living costs rising and talks of a recession, you can help increase someone's chances of employment by volunteering on the Rework programme. And I know what you're thinking right now. You're thinking, I would really love to help, but I just don't have the time, like... Where do I make the time in my diary to do this? Well, one of the least time consuming ways of helping is by joining our team of mock interviewers. So the time required for this is only one and a half hours every four months. That's one and a half hours every four months. So my question to you is, can you spare one and a half hours every four months? That's just a lunchtime and a half. So can you spare one and a half hours over four months, every four months? If the answer to that question is yes, you can actually sign up today at audaciousfoundation.com forward slash volunteer. At audaciousfoundation.com forward slash volunteer. And just remember that you have been given gifts to serve others. You have been given gifts to serve others. Thank you today, Audacious Church. It's been great spending this time with you. Have a blessed, blessed week. I love you loads and I will see you at church on Sunday. 
See you later. Take care. Bless you. Bye.